what led them to be who they are. Contradiction is not a sign of falsity, nor the lack of contradiction a sign of truth. Words of Blaise Pascal All of you have heard about Pascal. Yes, the SI unit of pressure. But do you know that this terming was used in honor of a great scientist Blaise Pascal? The scientist who worked in natural and applied sciences, the one who formulated theories in fluid mechanics, concepts of pressure and vacuum. Blaise Pascal was a French scientist, inventor and theologian, who contributed much of his works in his teenage and youth. His contributions to mathematics, physics and philosophy at a very young age are really astounding. Pascal was born in Clermont, France in June 19, 1623. His father, Etienne Pascal, was a prominent personality in the society, who was also interested in science and mathematics. Etienne Pascal was a presiding judge of the tax court in clermont ferrand Etienne was popularly known as a mathematician among his colleagues. Pascal's mother died when little Pascal was just three years old. His father, who never thought of a second marriage, gave prime importance for his children. Pascal had two sisters, the younger Jacqueline and elder Gilbert. Pascal's family was an upper middle class one. They moved to Paris after five years of his mother's death. And his father joined as a tax collector in Vroom. He was entirely educated by his father at home. He, being a child prodigy, seemed to have mingled with some of the best of the society and with some men of eminence in science and arts. The young Pascal showed amazing aptitude for mathematics and science. Pascal, at the age of 16, was inspired by the work of French mathematician Gerard Desargis, who is considered as one of the founders of projective geometry. Hence, the young Pascal started working on conics at his teenage. At this age, he produced a proof for a problem in short treatise on the mystic hexagram known as Essay on Conics. It states that if an hexagon is inscribed in a circle or conic, then the three intersection points of the opposite sides lie on a line known as Pascal's line. He sent his work to Pehmercine, a French polymath. René Descartes, a prominent mathematician, thought that this work was done by Pascal's father and not by a child of 16 years of age. He understood the truth only when Pahalmasin assured that it was Pascal's work. He commanded that this would scarcely occur to a 16 years old child. In 1642, at the age of 19, Pascal started pioneering works on calculating machines. He started such works so as to ease his father's job. His father, being a tax collector, came across a huge number of calculations. Within just three years of efforts and 50 prototypes, he built 20 finished machines called Pascal's calculators. He is still known as one of the inventor of the mechanical calculator. He in his young age, started working with Pehe de Forma on probability theory. He even proved the Aristotelian concept 
about vacuum is wrong at a very young age of 24. He questioned the Aristotle's argument which states vacuum cannot exist in nature. His work on fluid mechanics is still remarkable. A student nowadays cannot study about pressure without thinking of Pascal. His treatise on arithmetic triangle is also still discussed. Pascal was a strong religious man. He never questioned the existence of God and wrote several books on theology. Pense and Letter Provincials are such philosophical works of him. Throughout his life, he was in frail health, especially after the age of 18. He was just 39 when he left the world. He was a young scientist who won in making a great impact in science for centuries.